I think all businesses to some extent should read the report, especially those who don't necessarily think that next generation connectivity is, is relevant to them. We found that it is these more physical industrial sectors that stand the most to change from next generation connectivity. We found that there were a number of commonalities behind those who had uh, successfully adopted connectivity in general and those, those are certain things like hiring the right talent, getting on board the right expertise, uh, experimenting, setting up labs, making investments and that kind of thing. I think some of the early adopters would be uh, energy in particular, which is a sector that we found that placed uh, the most value on the strategic importance of, of 5G in particular. Um, other sectors might find that there are more barriers, there's more uncertainty about why they should be adopting it and there, there are more risks and uh, costs to, to weigh up. And then there are other sectors like digital businesses who will be adopting almost um, naturally owing to their uh, existing business. Uh, we're seeing a number of different uh, business models emerging. We're seeing particularly because of the ability to connect a range of devices that uh, some firms are moving to a sort of as, of as a service model where they are leasing products rather than selling them. There are also particular opportunities in healthcare and digital healthcare uh, to decentralise how uh, healthcare is provided. In the past, connectivity has been a, a huge force for social and economic change and often we don't know what those marginal gains in connectivity, uh, faster speeds of coverage and so on, might lead to, but we're already seeing that some sectors are, are really starting to invest in the idea and bullish about what it might bring.